All right, I'm going to show you how to stop the incessant bonnet removed issues on a litter robot. This is the version 3, but it probably applies to all litter robots. All right, so back here, once the, the, the egg, whatever, is removed, um, these are the contacts that send the light through for this guy. Um, and this is how it knows the bonnet's removed. This lifts off from the egg lifts off of this or it gets dirty or something, right? So um, it's a pain in the butt. I've cleaned it. I've tried a bunch of things. But what works is disassemble it, take the egg off, take the bonnet off, take the egg off, take the drawer out, take the power off, tip this thing back, and look down here. Um, in this cavity down here, there's some wires. And if you look close, you can see... There's a black and purple wire that leads up to where that contact point is that I showed you. Um, on the ends of those wires are going to be two little clips like this. Okay, If you just give a gentle pull, they should come free. And then you should have a black and purple cable like that. And let me twist it here. Let me, get a, let me show you here. There. So there's a black cable and a purple cable there. What I've done is just cut off those ends and twisted them together. So it used to run way back up there to where that little clip contact point is. Now it is right here. I just fished it down with a little, um, I reached in there with my hand and just unplugged it. It was pretty easy and I'm a big dude. You should be able to do it too. Uh, dig it out here, cut it, strip back the wires a little bit and twist them together. Um, you'll never have the bonnet error again. The only drawback is uh, the light. There's no more light in there. But uh, if your cats can crap in the dark, you should be all set.